Hello everybody, this is Laura Shapiro and I am here at my YouTube channel and today I'm going to tell you one of my video SEO tips on how to use a video transcript in your YouTube videos. Now first of all, why would you want to use a transcript? And basically the answer to that is just very simple. It's good for SEO because it allows the search engines to actually index the content of what you are saying on your videos. Now the description of course as we all know that helps you can put your keywords in there and give a general description but there's a, there's a character limit to how many words you can include in the description and while with the transcript you can put the full content right into the video and then it shows up on your screen and again this is text that's indexable by the search engines so it's really really a good idea to do these transcripts. Adding the transcript is very very simple the hardest part about it is probably actually doing the actual transcript which you can of course outsource and I would really recommend that you do outsource it to Odesk or one of those many outsourcing sites. You can do it for relatively cheap. Now let's just move along and I will show you how to put the transcript in. All you have to do is go into your channel, videos, Choose the video that you want to add your transcript to. Now I have chosen this really short one, it's less than a minute, and I've just prepared the transcript. I typed it out in a text file, so in in PC that's Notepad, and then Mac I think it's called Text Edit. You want to use a text file, don't use Word, because it comes out all weird. I've, I've tried that and the symbols all come out weird. You want to just use a normal text file. And I also want to point out that I name my text files the keywords that I'm trying to focus on in the video. And so you, would, you wouldn't want to try to do that too. Anything helps in terms of SEO. And so you, you find the video that you're going to add the transcript after you have the transcript. And then you hit underneath here, it says Insight. Click on the arrow next to Insight and you get a drop down box that says you want to choose Captions and Subtitles. Okay, and then here you will see add a caption track and right here is the button add new captions or transcript. And here you will browse your file again. I would suggest that you name it the keyword that you're trying to focus on or, or a couple of keywords that are focused on in your video. I'm just going to choose my text file. I named this one online video Brendan Bruchard. It's an interview where Brendan Bruchard talks about the importance of online video. Okay, this is important here. Under type, you choose the second option. It's automatically default is on caption file. You want to choose the second transcript file. I'm also going to name this my keyword again. And then you click on upload file. Okay, and it's thinking right now. All it's going to do is match the words up with the speakers, which is really kind of cool. It tries to fit them with what they're saying. I'll just take a second. Okay, and once you see that's done, then all you have to do is click on the video as your viewers will see it on the normal page. So you can click on your title right here. You don't actually have to click on the CC here. It comes up automatically. As you can see, my text is going right along with what the speaker is saying. So as you can see, this is a, just a really simple way to get those keywords in there and get your content indexed even more for your rankings and SEO and all that good stuff. Hopefully this helped and we'll see you in the next video.